on there. So that's it. Should I take this away? Yeah. Ooh, ooh, ooh. There goes the uh, camera. Put that down here. Mm -hmm. I'm just going to quickly take a picture of the damage mm -hmm. so that the, I can show the video as well to prove <laughs> that we haven't done the damage. Yeah. yeah, can I have a look at that? Mm -hmm. Yeah, so we just got the um, world of wizardry uh, geek gear in the uh, post, and it's got a little. After a little persuasion. After a little persuasion, yeah, we had a little bit of a problem getting there. So <laughs> let me just move that down here. Can I sit in? Yeah, <laughs> yeah. You alright? <laughs> We're dead. We bit. <laughs> Sorry. Yeah, we had a little bit of a problem trying to get that hold of this um, this geek gear this year. Oh, God, they've even got a hole in the front. Yeah. Yeah, I mean, we've been waiting for ages for this one to come through, and it didn't, um, in fact, it took us, uh, well, it took you. Um, Originally, it was meant to come on the 21st yeah. of March, um, and then the week went. What day is it now? It's now the 6th of April. The 6th of April, and it came today, did it? And it came today, yeah. After uh, calling them up and finding out that we, um, oh yeah, 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 it's currently down at the post office. We'll get that to you. And the state and condition of this is leaves a lot to be desired. I mean, like there's a little hole. That's right. Sorry, don't suppose you can see. It. There's like a little hole here. The entire box is creased, dented, and damaged a little bit. Which probably so. means it's been in storage for a very long time. Either that, or, or, crushed. either that or they did an Ace Ventura with it. I doubt it. <laughs> <laughs> no, I think what has happened is this has ended up under a lot of boxes over the Easter period. And I know they're uh, going to use the Easter period, but then as, again, like I excuse. said, <laughs> they had two weeks <laughs> before Easter. Yeah. Keep it be, keep it be, G, keep it be, G. Okay, well, we're just going to go uh, off to the... Now. Now we got it. <laughs> now we go. it. <laughs> So let's see what we got. Oh, so I'm just going to move in so we can actually see it. Ready? We, we, moving in, moving in. Okay, so what we got? We got cardboard box, cardboard piece box pieces. <laughs> <laughs> Yellow paper. I was going to say this looks kind of similar to the previous one. Hopefully they haven't messed it up. I'm just going to put the box to the side and I'll take stuff out one by one. Mm -hmm. Is that a new t-shirt? It is a new t-shirt. Cool. Looks a bit big on me. Well, I'll hold it up for the camera. What size is it? Medium. Okay. Oh, so what is that? That is Professor Lupin and that must be his werewolf. Ah. <laughs> one. Can they see it? Yeah, they can see that. Now, can you tell me what the name of the type of werewolf it is? <laughs> Actually, I'm, I'm, get, I'm, I'm getting my fingers up. Yeah, um, ignore me. I think I'm going... Uh, I'm getting different... Because there's supposed to be several different types of werewolves out there. Like a hex and beast. Or it's a... I think the actual name is actually, um, the clue is in his name of Lupus. Yeah. Lupus Lupin. It's like, it's like, a, it's like um, <laughs> a, a, a Lupus Terror, I think it is. Terror Lupin, maybe. I'm not sure. Beast of, um, beast of the Earth. Yeah. <laughs> oh, okay. I'm not sure. <laughs> I, need to, I will look that up. <laughs> Oh, sorry, I've just got a little bit distracted. What is that? Is that uh, a wand? It's better packed than the last one, <laughs> as it is. Or a pair of giant chopsticks. <laughs> ah. <laughs> it's a broken one. Well, that, that goes things thing with the case. Yeah, maybe. <laughs> Do you know what? I wonder whether this is... Rons. Yes. 
broken that, one. Yeah, that's what I, that was, that was what I was thinking. Oh, I see, because that's a, that, that, that's that a sellotape that he used to wrap it up. <laughs> oh, I couldn't tell if this was Ron's broken one. Or they actually broke it. <laughs> no, I think that is supposed to be... No, like, I think it? it is supposed to be like this. R Ron, Ron's no, I think broke. this is supposed to be Ron's. I was wondering whether this was meant to be um, Newt's disqualified wand before he repaired yeah, it. Yeah, because they said they snapped that one as well. Well, when you get um, disqualified from yeah. wizardry school, the it, first thing they do is snap your wand. But saying that, I mean... Uh, Short of you going to get my copy of Newt Scalamander's wand and comparing it, I think I think this is Ron's. Yeah, it certainly does look like. Uh, but it does ask the question: Who did I have last time? Is that a wand from this before? We thought it was Ron's. Ron's replacement one. I'm trying to think. Where did we put it? It's over there. Over here. Is it this this one? Yeah. Oops. Come here. That's, that, that, that's the death stick, isn't it? That might. That might be the. That might be the death wand, actually. Because that, that looks. That that's look, Newt's. That's Newt Scalamander's. That's Newt Scalamander's one that I got from. That looks more like um, he who must not be named's ones. Voldemort's. Yeah. Well, I'm not sure because it might be one of the ones that Voldemort borrowed from um, Malfoy's dad. Yeah, because I remember I remember Voldemort holding um, a wand with this particular type of hilt. Do you know what I do uh, in, 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 in the, the film. film as well? Yeah, I but I'm it. trying to think if that was the one that he got from Snape or no, no, Lucius no, no. Lucius Malfoy. The, that's what I'm depending on because uh, before he took. Um, Lucia, uh, Lucius Malfoy's. He he had a second. He had one wand with him, which um, he tried to bite, uh, beat uh, Harry Potter in Goblet of Fire. Yeah. I'm trying to remember if it's this wand, or whether it's the. Um... The funny thing is, in the booklet, it said that this was Ron's. I need to find the booklet again. I somehow don't think I that don't that's think Ron. That that doesn't look like a, a Ron type of wand, though, does it? That looks more like Ron. Yeah, that definitely looks like Ron. Second hand. <laughs> second hand. <laughs> oh, yeah. Because I remember, like I said, I think I saw um, him holding it like that as it went like, wee. <laughs> Avada Kedavra. <laughs> We'll have to do our research then. We'll have to find pictures of wands and compare. <laughs> Maybe we'll do a video on that. No, I'm joking. Well, <laughs> we not? do have a life. <laughs> yeah, unfortunately, that is mostly taken up with work, unfortunately. <laughs> yeah. Handcrafted house wax stamp. Wax stamp. So that's the wax. I think. Yeah, so that's the wax. So you basically heat that up to, to make a waxy residue and then you stamp that down on it. And that creates the house mark. I don't know if you can see this because I think the light is... But yeah. that's, that looks like the crest of a... Yeah. Oh, yes. Mm, mark that up. Oh, we can actually draw mm. as well. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, so basically what you do is you take a candle to that and you create a pool of wax, and then once it, once um, when you're ready, you just push that down, and it creates a wax seal. Yeah, that's an idea if we ever do a whole, uh, Harry Potter themed. <laughs> All right. Birthday. Ooh. Ooh. What's that? Some more cookery stuff. Ooh, cookery stuff. Good, 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 good. I think this is the, meant to be the golden snit, uh, golden snitch, or that could be Dobby's head. That well, I can see what you think it might be the golden snitch. It actually reminds me of a death head moth, but that was from Silence of the Lambs. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. Okay, little snitch uh, cookie cutters. Well, this is where I'm not a hundred percent because. I'm not 100% sure how that's meant to... What is that? I think it's meant to go like that. Or... That's a sorting hat. 
can you have way up? Oh yeah, there we go. I actually, I was more or less thinking of that way. <laughs> no, I think it's that way. <laughs> you got the brim, brim of the hat, and then you got the little hook on yeah. the top. Well, I was more or less thinking that is like the uh, yeah, the headpiece. Star Trek. <laughs> oh, Star Trek. I was going to say that's like the headpiece, and that's the little bit at the top, point flapping over. Yeah, but well, it's... I think the idea is it's meant to be like that. <laughs> Please put your comments and <laughs> suge suggestions in the comments down below. <laughs> and then, this looks like a, a wolf, or well, that could be a badger. Considering um, I'm, it'd be interesting to see if anyone's got a different type. Mm. Tell me if this is different. Uh, yes, oh, that looks more like a wolf, to be honest, mm. than a badger. I'm not sure if they could actually see it from that angle because it's like so thin, so you've got to put a bit of an angle. Ah, uh, yeah, it does kind of look like a, a wolf head or something. Have we got a booklet this time? Yes, we yeah, did! We've got a booklet. <laughs> okay, so what does the booklet say? Or shall we leave the booklet to last? Yeah, leave the booklet until last. Yeah, so we can have a little. Look. As we always do. <laughs> Which is why we got stuck in for everyone. Fe 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 remember February when we didn't have a booklet. And we yeah, were like, what is all this stuff? <laughs> we have no idea what it is. <laughs> yeah, we don't rehearse any of this. <laughs> this is, I would say this is all live, but this is live recorded. Oh, I need some new socks. Yeah, suckies. Geek Gear exclusive. I'm going to probably wear these tomorrow. <laughs> First pair of socks I wear that are not going to be. Full of holes. <laughs> we have holy socks. <laughs> religious. <laughs> the socks have gone religious fanatics. They're all holy. Mm -hmm. There we are. Wait. I'll try and, if I put them on my arm, <laughs> it's the tie, tie of the. Uh, can they you see that? The house. Can they see that? Yeah, they can see that. Looks weird, doesn't it? <laughs> I wonder if I can do a puppet. <laughs> okay. okay that's what? what did that look like? What did that look like? Um, like a person holding up a sock, going. <laughs> <laughs> Why can I not have any fun? You love you. <laughs> cute, cute. Ah. Uh -huh. Ooh, what's that? House pins. Ah. Jumper, but tie, tie and scarf. scarf. <laughs> I'm making the scarf actually. Are you? Yeah, knitting it myself. Oh, okay. How far have you gotten through on that? Uh... You haven't started yet. <laughs> <laughs> no, I've started. I'm okay. not quite far, but it's a bit thin. As in, how, how, how many strands of wool thin is it? It's about one strand of wool. Thin. <laughs> I might yeah. do double it. Ow. Weasley and just, Weasley spinning. T just gonna tilt this up a little bit so we can see you better. Yeah. Weasley and Weasley spinning top. A spinning. I'm wondering top. whether this is based on. It's interesting that this is claiming to be Weasley's because I'm wondering if this is actually based on Hermione's time. You remember time the time turner? Time turner. Well, I was wondering if it was one of these jokes, but that actually looks like a multicoloured pen. It is a multicoloured pen. Okay, that probably explains why it looks like a multicoloured pen. Yeah, it says on the bottom, multicoloured okay. pen. Yep, that explains <laughs> it. <laughs> I need to read my Harry Potter books again, because I don't remember them ever selling anything that had a spinning top. The only thing that I can remember that had anything resembling something that spins... Fireworks. <laughs> apart from the fireworks, was a Hermione's... Um, time Turner. Time Turner. Yeah, but that was more of a necklace type thing. Yeah, well, I'm wondering if this bit here is based on the time turner. This bit. Yeah. <laughs> I realise pointing at the back is not an help. No. <laughs> What's it actually say on it? It says Weasley and Weasley authentic. And it actually says on there authentic Weasley and Weasley spin in top. Now I know that the two twins were think well this was one of their but goals they were going to have a joke shop a joke shop known yeah. as Weasley and Weasley 
Yeah. So well, I'm wondering whether that Weasley and Weasley is a pun. If, but it's this bit that's confusing me. Mm. Well, because in their joke shop, they had loads of different stuff in there. They had hundreds of thousands of different things. So, I don't know, maybe it's one of... Interesting to look up. Yeah. But, yeah. Ah. Ooh, what's that? There we go. Magical butter cookies. Ooh, what's well, that for the uh, the cookbook? Yeah, oh. and this is the these are the cutters. Ah. So, well, gone, that is a snitch. Gone snitch. And you was right about that. Sort of <laughs> And it's an owl. <laughs> it's an owl. Completely wrong animal. Oh, <laughs> <laughs> well, you were right about the sorting hat. Yeah. <laughs> and the second ingredient is ooh, different type. The fever fudge, again based on Weasley. Okay, <laughs> I, I remember that. This this fudge would have got a student owl, feverish owl, and out of school. Out of uh, lessons, yeah. <laughs> no ideas, parents. <laughs> yeah, you basically eat one half of it and you become quite ill and sick and then you eat the other half to I think cure yourself or something? I can't remember. <laughs> and this is the, the butterscotch fudge. <laughs> oh, okay. The butterscotch. So I think this would have been on the top, the butterscotch fudge, and then that would have been underneath. Yeah. <laughs> That's how they would have sold it. <laughs> oh, what's that last thing you got there? Very snugly cut. Oh, Ooh, crumpled. Very crumpled. Oh. Everyone remember what type of bird this is? Fox. It's fox. <laughs> fox. The phoenix. It's a phoenix, Harry. I love <laughs> Phoenix. I'm going to have it like that. I'll sort this, all this stuff out tomorrow. Okay. So, shall so we? Let's have, have a, a look through the, the booklet. booklet. Mm. Let's have a look through the booklet. Now we've got the booklet again. <laughs> right, does it say, what's it say? Okay, <laughs> it says, it's Ron's broken wand. Oh, okay. We don't advise you cast too many spells with this wand. This hand-me-down from everyone's favourite red-headed family might well have you eating slugs. It mm. has seen better days. Yeah. <laughs> Preferably before it got shoved in the, uh, the car <laughs> to yeah. try and stop it. <laughs> What actually caused the fr what? Why actually broke the wand? Ron was try. Um, I think Ron was trying to stop the car mm. when he was when he finally arrived at Hogwarts. Mm. I'm trying to remember if he was in the Withering Willow at the time, the Withering Willow at the time. But the whole idea of it was that the um, he put his wand, I think, in the actual key bit, and what. It must have been when he after he'd got into the Withering Willows because something mm. made his made him do that movement with his wand, and mm. that was what caused it to snap. I would I would try if he just sat on it or because no. it got knocked around when he got been beaten up by that beating, by that beating tree. What was the Withering Willow? Is that what the uh, beating tree did? What it was called? Well, the Withering Willow trapped the car, and as far as I remember from the film, and I can't remember from the book, but I know definitely from the film. He was doing something to the car. I think he was jamming his wand inside the key bit. Okay. The key, um, to try and either restart the car or stop the car. Oh. And uh, his wand broke, if I remember rightly. I could be 100% wrong. <laughs> I have to look it up. <laughs> we, it's Weasley's multicolour pen. Jot down all your magical ideas with this cool Weasley and Weasley multicolour pen with six different colours. Oh, okay. Magical colour pen. <laughs> Put them in here while I'm looking at them. Where's the ones? I'll put all three ones in here for now. Mm -hmm. Hopefully I don't break it again. <laughs> the magical cookie cutters. Mm -hmm. The owl. Sorting hat and the golden snitch. Mm -hmm. This month we have included these metal cookie cutters to give you a helping hand with your included recipes. 
which are next on this list, which are these. Hey! <laughs> so, need to put these in the magic book. Yep. It needs to be thrown away. House pin set, which is that one. Oh, sorry. <laughs> Add to your pin collection with this fantastic three piece, three piece uh, badge set. Three pin piece These badge. These yeah. are high quality soft enamel pins with a secure back fastening. You will receive your chosen house, designed by one of our amazing subscribers. Me? Hey. <laughs> okay. The I wax should... stamp set. Yep. Keep in touch with your face. Sorry. <laughs> He's tired. He's only just sorry. got home. Mm. I'm sorry. Keep in touch with your favourite witches and wizards using this fabulous wax stamp set. To steal your letter. How do you think I feel after coming to work? <laughs> <laughs> I've been travelling for five hundred miles. <laughs> I've been, I've been, I've been, I've been, uh, I've been up since about five a.m. and then been travelling from four till uh, eight p.m. <laughs> ah, sorry. Just... You will receive your chosen house. <laughs> <laughs> the house tie socks, which I may wear tomorrow. <laughs> Love you, Han. I love you too. <laughs> this month you will receive a pair of quirky house tie socks. Wear them with pride. Okay. The looping t-shirt. Again, may wear tomorrow. Don't know yet. This striking t-shirt design depicts the most in unconventional defence against the dark arts teacher and his altar alternative form. I need to get my own loot crate. Wear the t-shirt <laughs> during the full moon if you dare. <laughs> and finally, the phoenix print. <laughs> Exclusive print shows the beloved magical creature of Albus Dun of Dumbledore. Pay attention to Fawkes as he may burst into flames before your very eyes. Does that mean we set it on fire? I don't know. <laughs> <laughs> oh, next month's box, box hint. Bring the Rabaska pan. <laughs> well, that might be interesting. <laughs> Ooh. Mm. 